All right, so we're discussing Sunshine today, and I honestly don't remember where I first saw this movie. I don't think I saw it in a class. I might have seen it in on break at college or or in high school or something like that. And I really haven't seen it in a few years. I think quite a number of years until I saw it again for this podcast after after suggesting it. And I really, really love this movie. I, I you know, I think most of the movie occurs after the, the major conflict. <laughs> it's like, you know, this post denouement film. Um, but I, I could really put this on, I think, and watch it anytime because mostly it's just about people having fun. Um, most of the movie is kind of spectacle and pleasure. Um, and that's kind of what I get out of it and what I really like about it. Yeah, this was a first watch for me. I uh, watched it for the show. Um, and as Tom mentioned, it's sunrise, not sunshine, actually, Tom. I thought the first act was amazing. It was creepy. It was intense. And I would paused and then started the movie again another time. And I thought I was watching a completely different movie. It, it changes a lot, as these guys are saying. But um, I enjoyed it. I enjoyed it a lot. So, yeah, I'm, I'm with Tom. I actually I don't remember when I first saw this movie. Um, I and I'd forgotten that I'd even seen it when I was watching it last night. I actually realized about you know ten minutes in that I had actually seen this movie before at some point. I thought maybe it was from one of my classes in college, but actually I checked with people and no one else that I went to those classes with and no one else had seen it. So I'm guessing that I probably watched this in like 2010, 2011 when I was doing lots of flights, um, and I used to just watch a lot of silent movies and so i'm guessing that's when i watched it um but i actually don't really know when i watched it i'm with tom it is it's a it's a it's a very it is a very beautiful movie and i i think it's um it's 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 not as tom says it's not necessarily the most plot driven film um which i'm totally fine with that so it's it's a very um very interesting film so this was also a first watch for me, and I was afraid I wouldn't even get to the first watch because for some reason, the version that I started to watch was defaulting to a commentary overlay from cinematographer John Bailey. Fortunately, I eventually came to my senses and found the way to turn it off so that I could actually hear the music and watch the movie in peace. It was a fun film. But uh, yeah, I was a little stressed out because I was cutting it close to the wire here and uh, I had some technical difficulties, which luckily I worked out just in time for the episode. 